All right, let's see if we can load it up again. Uh, see what happens. You never do know. Port four. Make sure, yeah. Let's do it. Come on, baby. Linking. Okay. And loading. Good. Okay. So this is basically going to start shrieking at me, probably. I'll tip it so it doesn't shriek. But let's go back to the Visuino program. All right. Now. Connect it. You see the raw values here? You gotta find where it balances. Right? He balances right about. There. So, I'm gonna take the raw value right there. Copy that. Go to the center. Take that number, paste it, okay? That is your center. And you upload it again. And it should be close to center right there and then you can fine tune it. You take your raw and you uh, add the difference or subtract the difference. Okay, now that basically worked. Um, what we're looking at here at the bottom on these numbers is the actual data coming out of the raw feed. So if you look at the raw, it'll start beeping right at, when the remap hits a five. All right, now the raw is right there and you want your steering in direction your speed and direction to be right about zero when you're balancing all right now if you need to tip it left or right all you do is you press hold again you find where you got to be all right press hold and then you highlight the raw only the raw and then you copy it find your center adjustment and paste it in to the center adjustment and then reload it and that is how you tune the PID roughly. That is before the, any Kalman filters, that's before any complementary filters, before anything. Because uh, to get a good stable signal, you have to have it stable first. So you got to do the filtering and everything I found before. Uh, because as I was trying to do the Kalman filter and everything, it was jumping all over the place because I didn't have a stable zero. A stable zero uh, center point balance point for it and that common filter would just keep speeding up and speeding up and speeding up and it would just keep going and going and going until it was maxed out on the motors and then the thing would lock up uh, because I couldn't get the center point right now by getting the uh, center adjustment and subtracting that value from 
uh, directly from the accelerometer you're getting a good base signal and you can clean it up from there with filters uh, after that but uh, let's see what we got here let's do the what do we got alright come on alright oh it's on hold that's why let's see what do I got yeah three three yeah remap is sitting right about five in the speed and direction is very very close to zero so that's how you tune your uh, remaps to get your speed to uh, your analog signal coming out of your gyroscope to feed the speed and direction